Hey everybody, welcome back if you're familiar with the channel, welcome along if you're, you're a newcomer, um, and welcome to my, my new studio. The uh, workshop of dreams and stuff is just through that door, um, and this was wasted space, so we cleared it out, got a few bits and pieces, worked from there. Anyway, this thing needs no real introduction if you've been to the channel before. The Arma Gorgon, this is the one that we built with my, my two youngsters and I've had quite a bit of fun with. Um, as I as I, I got to um, with one of the previous videos, the only downsides we could find with the truck is the kit servo saver um, let go on us. We replaced it with a heavy duty Kimber job and Yeah, that's not ideal. Um, I've sat, I've seen this, I've seen a few people saying about the same thing with this. Um, the downside being that Arma have this, this really, really clever uh, hidden body clip mounting system, which is great when you're fitting a kit shell bag on it, but unfortunately, you know, means you're limited in what you can do. Um, however, we have a solution. Isn't that much better? Proline 850 Chevy pickup truck, um, fitted, mounted to the chassis, as you'd expect, as with a normal RC car. Fitted using the standard Arma body mounts um, from the Big Brother. Fits directly into the end of the mounting points for the body shell. You then simply mount it on, clip it and away you go. You probably don't have to go quite as silly with a paint scheme as I have with this. Um, but yeah, um, I think you'll find not only is it great looking, but proper legs and tough as old boots too. Anyway, get rocking. We'll see you next. 